Uh, welcome to update four for the video log series on my uh, Cooler Master Half Stacker project, Cypress 29. Um, in my last video, I showed you the teardown of gray matter and kind of explained which parts are going to go where. And in this video, I'm going to build up the modded components that I have so far and some unmodded components just to test the hardware to make sure it's running. I want to uh, mod my motherboard and uh, I have a couple other things to mod and I want to test the parts and make sure they're up and, or, uh, up and running before I get too far into it. Uh, one of the main components for the teardown of gray matter that I needed was a 780 GTX. I had an EVGA 780 GTX OC edition uh, with the ACX cooler and that's what I was running in gray matter. I'm going to take the EK block off I had for that and put on the uh, Komodo block that Swift Tech had sponsored this build with. Um, there's also another one that needs to be modded still and I'm gonna purchase the other card. That's the only card, I, uh, only big purchase I need to finish the project. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove this card and uh, or remove this block and put this block on. So I can, I'm really excited to do that. This is a really cool block and uh, this will be the first step that I'm gonna build everything up on my Primo Chill wet bench that they uh, sent, sent to me for uh, testing components. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and get into it. Okay, now that I've changed the graphics card water block to the new Komodo block, it's time to install everything on here and power it up and I'm going to go ahead and uh, install Windows 8 on my solid states once I get them set up in uh, RAID 0. 
and uh, make sure everything's running correct. And then I'll probably take everything off of here and power up the Gray Matters components on here, and then that'll be my daily driver computer for now until Cypress is done. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, install all the components and uh, start uh, putting the water loop together. Okay, so after looking everything over, I have not made my extension cables for the power supply yet because they're going to be custom made. These are going to be flush mounted into the panels in there and uh, I'm going to be using solid copper wire. Uh, it'll be shielded, but it'll be solid strand so I can bend the wires how I want to and I'm going to do some unique wiring in here with my extension cables and I haven't got around to making those yet. I was waiting until I started on the electronics. So I'm gonna use my old thermal take 1000 watt power supply and just power it up with the, just to test. Really the only thing I wanna get out of this test is to boot up the solid states, install my operating system and make sure my motherboard works. I don't even think I'm gonna water cool this. I'm gonna to try to avoid to. So I just, just to get, get a couple things tested, get the operating system on and get up and running and then uh, I know my motherboard's ready to mod. I'll take off the shell and paint it and do everything I need to do. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the stock cooler thrown on real quick, get this booted up and get uh, Windows 8 installed. And uh, then we'll be on to the next. I'm going to just do a quick test on air and then get right into modding the motherboard and the memory and some other things and then I can get the motherboard inside the project and then I'm going to set up Gray Matters old hardware on the test bench and run that full time for now. Alright well so far so good. Um, all the components that I needed are on the test bench. I got the motherboard, the memory, the graphics card set aside. I know that works but I really just wanted to get my operating system up on my hard drives get them set up in RAID 0 and test my motherboard make sure it's working and everything seems to be rocking so um, that's probably going to end this update um, it'll be update 4 for the Cypress 29 video log uh, quick shout out to my sponsors Primo Chill, Mod Smart, Swift Tech, Cooler Master and CaseFeet.com you guys are awesome uh, thank you for your continued support and uh, yeah that's it for this video next update I'm going to get into modding some of these components I think motherboard is first on deck and then you know, just keep plugging away and nailing out these details that I got left on the case. So, um, thanks for watching. If you guys like the video, go ahead and subscribe, share it with your friends. Uh, I'm also going to be starting to take side work. Uh, as soon as Cypress 29 is done, Black Frost is going to kind of be a, a, an in-between build a stage where I'm going to have some extra free time and I'm going to be taking a, taking on side projects. So, uh, give me an email at clockworkcasemods at gmail.com and uh, we'll see what we can work out. Alright, thanks again for watching.